Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name's Andrew. Today I'm checking out Reacher Season 2, Episode 2. It looks like someone's coming after Reacher's old squad. They've already got two, so they'll probably be tracking down the rest of them. So let's just get straight into it. So if someone's coming after the 110, how come they haven't made a run at the three of us yet? You were in the woods with your family. No one can ever find me and maybe they just hadn't gotten around to Neil yet. Probably the harder ones to track down. Look at this fucking butte. What's he think he's gonna do? <laughs> I don't know if that would actually work, but it looks cool. Gun! Dropped him fast. As he always does. Good old days. Yeah. You on the sidelines while I do all the work. <laughs> uh, fellas. This was his gun. Okay. NYPD. Is he called? Name's Gaetano Russo. Why are they following him around? Major screw up. As soon as Russo wakes up, the entire NYPD's gonna be after your ass. Why'd you gotta hit him so hard, huh? I don't hit soft. <laughs> yeah. Well, cop puncher's gonna do some serious time. I was pissed about the dog, and I assumed he was involved in killing Franzi and Swan. Yeah, he never identified himself as a cult, <laughs> but you still can't go around knocking people out. He's the investigating officer in Francis' homicide. I saw it in the files. And how did he get on your tail? They're investigating him. Franz made to you. Flagged your name. Got an alert when you bought the plane tickets. Been on you since you landed. Question is why. Question is where. Okay. He kicked the car. Then he pulled the cop out, and he knocked his dick in the dirt. I'm telling you, this guy's a beast. When the time comes, I'm gonna need some backup. And you'll get it. Okay, so these two aren't working with the other guy? I thought they were all working together, but I guess not. We can't run anything under our names. Oh, we drive around in a stolen vehicle. We risk getting pinched. I've got our solution. That was your undercover job. Reacher? Okay. Just randomly running into an old friend? What's with all the secrecy? Billy O'Donnell and I have been flagged in the system. And I punched out a cop. <laughs> Franz. Yeah. And Swan, most likely. Sanchez and Roscoe are MIA too. He could still be alive, just being tortured. They haven't found his body yet. And we still have no idea about the rest of them. Make sure you get an SUV. I know. You need the headroom. You can't get a tiny car with this guy around. <laughs> That'd be funny to watch, but. See, I noticed that every time fuel went missing from the base, it was always after a specific flight. Whenever C-17s ferried Humvees back home to the States. They're taking detours? You're not putting on the books? So, how does all that fuel go missing? Best way to make gas disappear is to burn it up. Exactly. Yep, they're using it to go somewhere. The excess fuel is being used to transport more weight than people realize is on the plane. Yeah. Okay. Something heavy and... Okay, so they're not going anywhere. They're just moving extra stuff. Good work, Dixon. You just found a case worthy of our attention. Transporting illegal goods? Maybe it's someone with a grudge against the one tenth. We've arrested a lot of people. What about James Barr? I mean, that guy's got the skills and the screw loose. Can't picture him throwing someone out of a helicopter. Plus, I ran into him in Indiana last year. He owes me now. Okay. Well, this is a story we could have had. It's got to be one of the stories in the books. When you get there, take him out. Copy that. You remember what I said about needing backup? I know some local talent. I'll bring in whoever you need. Yeah, that dude's definitely gonna need a lot of help. Fucking dead. Okay. Well, I'm guessing that's the dude that Greece is gonna kill in the last episode? Just like Franz's office. And our hotel rooms. You said they hadn't trashed Swan's place. Yep. Add that to the list of things that must mean something. Oh, yeah, that's interesting. Guess I didn't think that he would have it. Whatever they're looking for. You two stay here. Both look like cops. What do you two <laughs> look like? Not cops? These guys say they're friends of Sanchez. Want to talk to Molina. Take him back to the office. She's doing the books. <laughs> okay. I think this is going to end in the fight. Molina. They're trying to protect her. I get that he's a different kind of guy, but our commanding officer buys used underwear. 
<laughs> oh, he doesn't even buy new underwear. What's going on, fellas? You guys are gonna stop coming around here messing with our friends. Look, pal. We somehow got the <laughs> hey, yeah. Well, hopefully Richard takes it a little bit easy on these guys. Okay, head to a wall. Guess it's not going too easy. <laughs> yeah. Gotta find out who's been coming around here and go after them. Scary dude came in here asking for about a week ago. Said he was working with Sanchez and Orozco on some big security job. Okay. You're all working on something? And you come in claiming to know Sanchez. Looking like the kind of people somebody had hired or rushed someone up. No offense. I just assumed you were bad news. <laughs> well, he is bad news. To certain people. Maybe this isn't about someone with a grudge against the 110. You ever notice it's pretty likely four of us have already been killed already? Melina said Franz was here a couple weeks. But they're all working on the same case. It made them think we were all in danger. They would have called then. Not weeks later. But they all got involved somehow. Because they're after him now. Or maybe they just think that one of them sent the information to them. And that's why they're coming after him. Hold on. Uh, you just said knew them. Past tense. We have reason to believe they might be dead. The, yeah, they're probably all dead. You know, this this might take a few hours. Where you guys stand? Don't know yet. Please allow me. Not necessary. I don't know. Any friends of Sanchez and Orozco? He probably just wants to keep him close. Come on, I'll get you guys settled in. We'll be fine at a motel. Reacher? He's gonna settle them in himself? Yeah, we'll have him to up a park bench to sleep on. We'll feel right at home. <laughs> yeah. Was that about a motel, Reacher? Whoa. I bet this place has a spa. <laughs> we'll take a spitz. Fancy. Yeah, I'll never get to stay in a place like this. Long and packed. <laughs> yep. You brought a new toothbrush? Okay, no. You just taped it back together. Uh. Who knows what else they did with that toothbrush? There's no way I'll be using that again. What, you didn't know? Someone finally lassoed our little filly. No. Um, didn't. Yeah, he doesn't know anything about their lives. <laughs> He's been out of touch for like a few years. I was relieved. I mean, he's a decent man. I don't know if you're gonna spend the rest of your life. <laughs> oh, he's smiling. He still thinks he's got a shot now. Buy and build equity. Get a condo. Co-ops are fucking banana republics. Yeah. <laughs> he's getting bored with all this talk. What kind of lunatic is picking up the world's biggest drifter? It can be interesting. Where do you eat? I steal pie off windowsills. <laughs> Had a great night's sleep in a hammock I spotted in some guy's backyard once till the sprinklers went off. Good God, man. <laughs> Sleeping in someone's backyard. Don't you ever get lonely? I'm gonna take that as a yes. Looks like someone took the sign as a personal challenge. Green, I'm just warming up. <laughs> He's a big boy. Looks like I'm not the only one who couldn't sleep. Numbers relax me. I figured if I was going to do math, I might as well make some walking around money. Stand. Ma'am. She's probably going to get in trouble for counting cards. Congratulations, ma'am. You're having a very lucky night. Maybe you'd like to celebrate with a concert on us. And we know you're counting cards. <laughs> Which isn't illegal if you do it in your head. But seeing that your chief of security was kind enough to compass. Trying to kick her off the table nicely? I mean, come on, Rachel. It's not like I didn't drop any hints. I was your boss. Wouldn't have been right. Wow. Yeah, they're definitely gonna hook well, up. I waited years for that answer, and it's pure reacher. <laughs> what would have been pretty obvious? What do you want to do about the two guys that are following us? I think he only knows how to do one thing. I think he's gonna do what he does best. We open fire in a residential area. Cops get called. You get locked up. Let's do this without guns. Looks like they had the same idea. They got knives. It's not going to help them much. Hopefully these aren't all the guys that, that other fella brought to take these guys out. Surely he's got to know that it's going to take more than these three guys. Ah! <laughs> oh, he got cut. Well, I think you might have made him angry. 
<laughs> oh, that's gonna hurt. They don't that chat. There's one there. Yeah, this dude should have brought more than these two guys. He nearly got it there. Eh? Closer than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Might want to keep him alive. Okay. <laughs> Why did they kill him for? When we were kids, we just wrote our names in it. He can't talk now. I think Richie's got to learn to keep some people alive. Is it done? Not in the way you expected. Leaf straight back to him already. Guess I didn't need to keep him alive. You should know that this doesn't end well for you. Then why are you the one that sounds scared? <laughs> yeah, I think it's gonna be the opposite. Nothing to ID any of them. These guys are pros. Should have left one of them alive. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they really should have. Didn't have a choice, did they? Maybe not. You had some choice with that last guy. Didn't have to drown him in the cement. And what are we gonna do about those bodies? Uh, leave him there? I have an idea. Okay. Hide him. Yeah. These two are definitely hooking up tonight. And you're not my boss anymore. There's no better time. <laughs> Does that any matter of time? All 650 will be in the truck. You can track the shipment with a GPS locator I paired to this. This connects to the numbers somehow. 650, 100k. And the weapons? They'll all be used overseas. I was told that was the deal. Absolutely. Okay. Truck driver won't be harmed. Selling weapons? Of course. I would never harm anyone. <laughs> okay. There's no way that guy believes that. Morning, Bitson. We need to talk to you about what happened last night. Oh, the whole hotel heard what happened last night. <laughs> Two more bodies have been discovered in upstate New York, near where they found your other friend. Judging by the decomposition, they've been there a while. Two more of them. How many of these squad is left unaccounted for? Ain't no one has hit any of the casinos. You don't have yeah. anything to worry about. Bodies I think it's about casinos. The car that followed us is from New York. New York ghost tags. It's about the guns. This has always been a New York case. Hell you going? So that guy turned out to be helpful? We're gonna need more guns. I thought it might have become difficult, but turned out to be very helpful. Now they reeled out the gambling aspect. I think they're gonna be heading back to New York. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. If you made it far, give it a like, comment below, subscribe, and I'm gonna get straight into the next one. So I'll see you there. Bye.